Welcome to JSA TV and JSA Podcasts, the newsroom for telecom and data center professionals. I'm Barb Mitchell coming to you from ITW 2020. Joining me today is Todd Cushing, president of 1623 Farnham. Todd, welcome to JSA TV. Thank you for having me. It, it's great to have you. And, and what we would love is if you could just maybe start by giving us a bit of an overview of 1623 Farnham. Sure, a little bit about the building, the facility itself, is it's owned by us and managed by us. It's a 76,000 foot building. It's nine floors above ground, two floors below, and its uh, focus is interconnection. So really, it's a carrier hotel traditionally is what it's been for almost 20 years, but now it's really an interconnection facility at this point. And I understand you're undergoing a $40 million expansion currently. Can you, can you tell us a little bit about the data center upgrades and enhancement, maybe when it's going to be ready? Sure, we've always been N plus one, but now we're gonna have all new electrical, all new mechanical, new security and building management to the facility. The seventh floor is gonna be available for leasing in uh, the 12th of August. And we're gonna commission the new mechanical electrical on uh, mid-October-ish this year. Okay, yeah, it's timely. I mean, a robust interconnection is so critical for so many organizations. What does 1623 Farnham specifically offer to address that? It's, well, we have approximately 50 carriers, phone carriers in our facility, content providers, people that are doing interconnection in our facility, peering because of the IX, but we also have on-ramps to the facility. So we have Charlie Cloud, CenturyLink, and Google on-ramp here. And with that, we have uh, their tenants and content providers in our facility. We also have Megaport, which will be in production in July. So really, it's about interconnection. Wow. And you're also host to the premier Midwest Internet Exchange, Omaha IX. Can you tell us what that means for your customers? Sure, the Omaha IX is really about lower cost transport and peering. So your ability to connect to others that have content, have your path be more direct, and having them more direct, you have less opportunity for security problems, uh, less hops. So it's, it's, it's uh, more economical, it's lower cost. Their IXs have been around in Europe. They're widely accepted there. There's more and more acceptance of IXs in the, the Midwest and other parts of the, of the country. But we, we own the Omaha IX and um, we're expanding it. We are looking to tether it in other cities around the Omaha Metro. Wow. Wow, that's all great updates. Can you give us a little bit about, you know, we're sort of halfway through, if you can believe it, 2020 already. What does the rest of the year look like for you? You know, we're going to wrap up the mechanical electrical upgrades, do our commissioning, but we've also got new carriers coming on board. So we've got a few more carriers. I think there's three, four more carriers will be on new fiber from existing uh, clients that are that are um, expanding onto other new floors, reworking their footprint here, which we're happy about. But we also have three new routes coming in from Chicago or, or Denver uh, into our facility they're building. And it's really driven by the hyperscale. So there's a lot of hyperscale in the Omaha Metro. Uh, Google's got four presences, five, you know, Facebook's got a presence. They interconnect with our facility. So we've got a lot of uh, new growth going on for those hyperscale in our facility. So we'll be boarding on new uh, new tenants that'll be, uh, again, for that ecosystem that the interconnection is so important for, we'll be expanding that via those relationships. So uh, new lobby is going to be happening in first quarter and new security desk. And so we're real excited to put a new face on the front of the building on the north side. Wow, so so much already happening and, and so many exciting things to look forward to. Where can our viewers go to learn more about 1623 Farnham? We've got a great new website that JSA helped us out with. So it's uh, 1623farnham.com, or you can also check out the omaix.com and uh, take a look at it and just if you have questions, contact us. Fantastic, okay. Well, Todd, thank you so much for your time today. We really appreciate you joining us. And thank you viewers for tuning in to JSA TV and JSA podcasts. Happy networking.